Hey guys, Viper G13 here. Uh, today, I have a really quick video, or maybe it could be long. Not sure. Um, just update on like a review of every pocket I have. Um, what type of mesh it is, or type of stringing. First, I have the Western from Colorado Cobra Pocket. Um, Cobra Pocket. Uh, it's a little heavier because of all the string you use. Um, you get a faster shot, not as much hold. But, um, you know, it, it does take time to break in and get used to it, I guess, in a little bit, but it should work fine. Um, again, not as much hold, but you have a fast shot. Some people say it's for looks, but it could be a performance pocket, too. Um, next, I have a, the Gimelax 6-diamond mesh. Um, I have a few friends that have used it, too. Um, I haven't really used this stick as much, so it's not as broken in, but um, the mesh does break in, and it does become, like, a lot softer, like, if you go like that, it will go in a lot easier, so, it does break in quick, um, major thing is to keep the top really tight, and just use one hole, don't even double up, I noticed that too, um, but yeah, other than that, it's, a uh, Forms a nice pocket once you start using it. Throws nice. Uh, all depends on how you string. You can put good hold, nice release, stuff like that. Um, you know, all around good six diamond mesh in my opinion. Um, next I have Jim Wax um, from JimLax.com. Jim Wax uh, wax I should say is another type of wax mesh. There's so many out there. Um, it flakes a lot when you string, so most of the coating comes off. Um, it's still water resistant, um, but it does flake, which is one of the most like horrible things to, to happen. But it does hold up after a few weeks. Um, but it is, an, it will turn into like a softer, like water resistant mesh. It's like soft mesh, but water resistant. Um, again, I haven't played with this as much, so. I'm not sure, but I have played it on other sticks, but I've taken it off just because of the way I get um, wore out. Uh, next, I have Delax Wax um, from Delax94. Uh, he makes his own custom mesh. Um, so it's a nice, uh, it's probably my favorite. I have it on my game stick. Uh, A STX surgeon uh, strung for uh, breast cancer. Nice like um, bag or low mid pocket in my opinion. Um, found it easier for because I'm a midi, so the ball sit down here and it can go up higher. So I like. I mean, I like it. So, um, but yeah. So Delax wax, water resistant. So much water resistant. Guy, I was playing with it uh, probably about a week or two ago. And uh, it rained that morning, and everybody's mesh was all bagging out and throwing down and stuff like that. And mine was fine. So, it's definitely water resistant, easy to string. Um, uh, as of the way you string it, you can add good hold. Again, I put like a mid low pocket on this one, too. Um, but, you know, nice. I like it. I definitely like, you know, advise you guys to go get yourself a piece of it. It's so nice. Um, next on my deep hole, I mean, I don't really use this at all, maybe like the full round of the backyard, Jim Lax's, um, American mesh, it's like soft mesh, just two times as thick, um, sort of water resistant, but, you know, every mesh is gonna have to give out at some point, um, but it's nice, uh, nice release when you put a nice pocket put like a mid-high pocket on this for some reason just to fuck around, you know, just my mess around stick, but, um, it's easier to string up, uh, um, you know, not much to say, all it depends on how you string your sticks, but it's definitely water resistant, it's nice, you know, um, works well, if you're a type of, like, soft mesh type of person or something, uh, go and try it, you know, it's always worth a try. It doesn't work it doesn't work you know you can always make that like five to like ten bucks back easy you know maybe like a little bit over that but you're, you can make it back easy you know um so yeah uh Jim Lax, uh american mesh
It's awfully nice. Um, I had rubber mesh, but I uh, had it on one of my sticks one day, and a good friend of mine was asked me if he can use my stick because his was like the sidewall ripped or something, and he started to use it, and uh, he said his opinion was. Um, it's so, for some reason it's easier to catch. Um, like I play in a varsity team, so I was like, you can't catch or something. But I don't know. So when he threw, when I threw it to him, he like caught it, and because of the rubber and the sticky mesh, it like was easier to catch. It like I guess you could say stuck or was easier to catch. Um, all depends on how you string it with the release and everything. But that was nice too. Um, that it was a wet out that day too, and held up really well. So I'm surprised, you know. Um, but I gave that to him, you know, I just thought, I took it off my stick and was like, hey, if you want it, you can have it, you know. Um, and, uh, I ha lent out another stick to my friend, uh, during practice his sidewall broke. We have a game tomorrow, so I just, um, was like, hey, why don't you just take mine, use it for tomorrow, and I'll fix your sidewall tomorrow and get everything done that you need. Um. So that was Jim Jim Lack's hard mesh. Hard mesh was just it's nice, easier to break in. I found that if you soak the mesh for like an hour as you before you just string off the belt, everything on the outside, no shooting strings or nylons or anything like that. You soak it for like about an hour and then take it out and then just um, let it dry a little bit and then put your shooters on. It's it breaks in so much easier. I'm broken within like two or three days. Um, so definitely, definitely a really nice hard mesh, you know. Um, I might be making Jim Lax order soon. I don't know yet. I'm going to try out the Ruby mesh. Um, I want to try semi-hard. I'm going to just get a few pieces of, like, hard. Um, my local store has six diamond, and so if I want to try out a six diamond piece again, you know. So that's about it. Um, quick thing. Uh... I uh, have a question about goalie sticks. Um, I was stringing one for a customer, and uh, I mean, this is not a goalie stick, of course, but the goalie sticks are out here. And what the pocket would happen was um, I didn't double up or anything, I just every hole, and it's a 10 diamond Jim uh goalie mesh. And like, what would happen? I don't know if you can really see it because of the shooters or anything, but like, it'd like hook on like this like really badly and it throw straight to the ground so I like I put it all like normal and I didn't double up and then it like got a little bit better but is there any way like to make it not you know go do that and release like it was bad it was thrown to the ground I mean I fixed it and then did it a little better I might tweak it tomorrow like before I have to bring it back to the store but that's about it um so I just want to say uh, thanks for watching, guys. Um, you know, sorry I haven't gotten videos out. I've been busy, but um, you know, I uh, quick. I know I made a video on it. Um, probably when you're gonna be selling Mike Powell voice or Mikey Powell. Sorry, uh, not sure about prices. Uh, Warrior stiffy, strong or unstrong, as for both of them. I might just take off this mesh, put regular ten diamond hard mesh on it. Um, but I, I kind of want to keep the six diamond. Um, maybe I don't know yet. This is a Brian Clutch. If anyone's asking with Jim Wack, I might ha just restring it with different colors and just use the same mesh. Um, but I mean, this is a pretty sick head. I'm not gonna lie. So let me know what you guys if you guys are interested in those things. Shafts, real quick. I don't know that what a type. But it's an Adidas um, something, I don't know. Got on from a friend, brand new. His like dad or something got him, I don't know. But whatever. Um, and a Harrow Monster trying to get rid of this, you know. Anybody. Um, trades, even for sale. Let me know what you guys, you know, think. Um, so, you know. Not sure, you know, I'll let you guys know with updates because I know a couple kids were asking about it. Um, those sticks about, you know, just on my team. So I'll let you know, like, what the availability is on.
on them. Um, so just, yeah. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, good luck with your seasons with lax, because I know that's, that's brand new in the season. And if you need anything strong, even though it's season already, just let me know. Ship it out quick. I'll string it and then ship it back out. But, uh, alright guys, thanks for watching.